Creepy to some, fascinating to others. Spiders have crawled across the earth for hundreds of millions of years. But don't be afraid, they aren't monsters. They're master engineers, patient hunters, and quiet recyclers of nature. With eight legs, eight eyes, and a toolkit of silken fangs, spiders are among the most skilled predators in the animal kingdom. In this episode of Wild Wonders, we'll step into the web of one of nature's most misunderstood marvels. Welcome to the incredible world of spiders. Spiders are found almost everywhere on Earth, from hot deserts and cool forests to your own backyard. They live on mountaintops, in caves, deep in jungles, and even underwater. Each species has its own favorite habitat. Some spin webs in trees, while others hide in burrows underground. You might even find a spider living quietly in the corner of your home, keeping insect pests in check. Spiders have been around for more than 300 million years, and scientists believe they evolved from ancient crab-like ancestors. Today, there are over 48,000 species of spiders around the world, each one adapted to survive in its own special way. In this segment, we explore where spiders live and how they've evolved to thrive in some of the planet's most surprising. Spiders may be small, but their bodies are packed with surprises. Most spiders have eight legs and eight eyes, though some have fewer eyes depending on the species. They don't have bones, instead their bodies are protected by a tough outer shell called an exoskeleton. Spiders have special silk glands called spinnerets near their back end. With these, they spin webs, build nests, wrap prey, and even create tiny parachutes to float on the wind. They also have fangs that deliver venom. Not all spiders are dangerous, but many use venom to catch and digest insects. And their tiny hairs, they help spiders feel vibrations, sense danger, and even taste what they touch. Spiders may be silent, but they're always busy. Most spiders are solitary. They live, hunt, and build webs alone. Web-spinning spiders create beautiful traps to catch insects. Some build classic spiral webs, others make funnel webs or tangled messes in corners. Other spiders don't spin webs at all. They hunt their prey by jumping, ambushing, or even fishing from water surfaces. Spiders are nocturnal, meaning they do most of their hunting at night. During the day, they hide in silk-lined burrows, curled leaves, or web retreats. Some female spiders guard their egg sacs until the babies hatch, while others let the wind carry the young away on silk threads. In this segment, we explore how spiders live their lives, from spinning and stalking to raising the next generation. Some spiders can walk on water using the surface tension, almost like skating. The Goliath bird eater is the world's largest spider. It's as big as a dinner plate. Baby spiders hatch from egg sacs and sometimes travel by ballooning, using silk to float through the air. Some spiders dance to attract mates, really. Jumping spiders use their legs and colors to put on a show. Not all spiders spin webs. Some are clever hunters, while others trap prey in tunnels or sticky pads. Spiders may be tiny, but they make a big difference. Spiders help control insect populations, eating mosquitoes, flies, and crop pests. That's great news for farmers, forests, and even your backyard. And while many people fear spiders, most are harmless, and they'd rather hide than bite. Some spiders are even studied by scientists to help design strong, stretchy materials because spider silk is stronger than steel by weight. Conservation groups help protect spider habitats, especially in rainforests and grasslands where rare species live. You can help spiders by respecting their space, keeping gardens healthy and teaching others why they matter. Let's remember what we've discovered. Spiders are smart, helpful hunters. They spin silk, build webs, and sometimes even dance. And they've been here long before the dinosaurs. When we protect spiders, we help keep ecosystems in balance. Thanks for exploring with us. Until next time, keep wondering.